fuck you, my child is completely fine. Um, I'm afraid I found weed in your possession. Mother. Okay, someone drew, someone put their persona pointing a gun at me and said, "Show us what's inside the fridge, Wayne." You want the truth? You want the truth? You want the fucking truth? Oh, there is no fridge. I know. <laughs> it was never real. Do you want to know if the characters you're attracted to makes you a furry? Well, I present to you Vanilla to Bestiality, the Am I a Furry Linear Alignment Chart. Note, I mean no hate to furries, this is a pro-furry account, and if I knew how to make a fursuit, I myself would likely be a furry. First up we have No, These Are People. Note how all of these are people. Next up we have No, These Are Mostly People. These characters usually only have one animal-like attribute. Next up we have Not a Furry, Just Weird. Though you are not a furry, this attraction is still questionable. Next up we have what I call Classic Furry. A good 50-50 split of animal and human attributes. Next up we have still furry but getting bold. Less human attributes than the previous category. Here we have you're on thin fucking ice. The only thing defending you is the fact that these characters can all talk. Next up we have yikes. You should be lucky that these are fictional characters. And last but not least we have that is an actual animal. No the pain, no the day bleeds. It's a nightfall, and you know he is a